Bell Gorge. It's uh, 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Numbers are starting to thin out. Car park was chockers. Don't know where everyone is. But it's looking beautiful. So I'll go down and have a swim. That's the top of Bell's Gorge. Waterfalls are just around to the left. Can't quite see them from here. Get a great view of the rock pools downstream, which is where we're going to head today. Go for a swim down there again. of the uh, end of the swimming there's just one big plunge left Well, today we have arrived at Mount Barnett, Manning Gorge, not without a... Oops, a little bit fast on the stop button there, Lise. 
Yeah, looks like we had a bit of an issue with the shockies there. Lost a bolt and dropped the shockies. Unfortunately, we were able to get a couple of spares from Nev at Over the Range Tire Centre and uh, fit them to the van and we we're back on the road. <laughs> it's beautiful and warm. <laughs> so Manning Gorge, as you might see, the little boats disappeared. So it's a swim across the river. Nice and warm, nine o'clock in the morning. Not 9 30 actually, bit of a late start. There used to be a little boat here, you'd be able to get in and uh, pull yourself across the river. But uh, I'm not sure why that's disappeared. I'm sure there's a uh, insurance reason why. But we've got our trusty King's bags that we got with our uh, inflatable sups and uh, they finally come in handy. There it is. Waterfalls at Manning Gorge. At the top of the falls, just going for a walk upstream. You noticed last time there was a bunch of swimming holes up this way, so just have a wander, get away from the crowds, find a coffee shop. There we are. That's what we uh, came up for. It's gorgeous. So that's about, what time we leave? It's about uh, 9.30 I think. It's just on 11 o'clock. So it's about a 45 minute trek up from the waterfalls. It's just these beautiful billabongs up here. That's what they call them in WA. It's just stunning. Not a soul. Not a soul, not a pool noodle, not an inflatable flamingo. Nothing. I can have a look at that little beach. I'll sit up there and have a swim. Nice little assortment of uh, wildlife tracks there. So just down here is a goanna. Obviously some looks like a dingo or a wild dog of some sort. And some kangaroo prints. See so over there looks like the goanna came out of the water, so it must have swum across. How oh, cool. Looks like we found our lunch spot. Nice shady little tree. Sandy beach. Crocodiles in there. So that's it. That's so from here we're going to go to Mount Elizabeth Station. We've decided. So we're going to keep pushing east. We were going to double back to Broome from here, but we're not going to do that now. We're going to push east, do Mount Elizabeth, and then uh, carry on through to Kananara and do the bungles and uh, and um, Lake Argyle. Yeah, Lake Argyle. So uh, that'll be the next adventure. Radio. We'll catch See you, you then. See ya.